Hello everyone, it's Brett here, Lionheart84, and we've got some quite, um, for me, quite exciting stuff happening this year on some of my tropicals. Uh, this is my tallest tropical guava that I've opened in the kitchen, not a strawberry guava, but the actual one I call proper tropical guava, Obsidian Java. Now this particular plant last summer produced a few flower buds right at the very, well, well, not really summer even I'd say into going into autumn and the buds did eventually after a few weeks manage to open and flower but of course it didn't set any fruit it was much too late in the year however this year despite losing all its leaves in the kitchen it's got hopefully you can see there are some flower buds there and there as well as those there so it has actually got a few flower buds appearing on it this year um not sure i can see all the stems on it they're the only ones i can see at the moment but we're only at the end of june when i'm filming this so it, they're way way earlier than last year now that would suggest that these flowers should open probably the middle of july um, so there's an outside chance, if this is a self-fertile plant, that perhaps I'll get a couple of fruits set on it. Now whether or not I could successfully grow a guava fruit to maturity, given the time, the number of months they take, I don't know. But whatever happens, if you don't get flowers, you definitely aren't going to get fruits. And the main thing is there are flower buds on this, so... Uh, fingers crossed that we're going to see something happen obviously I'm going to when it flowers I will do an update video on it and if by any chance any of these flowers set fruit there will be videos on that as well because it will be interesting to see how far they develop before um, b before being dropped by the plant because it's going to be very uh, weather dependent on us obviously keeping the fruits on the plant in winter indoors it's going to be very difficult with a dry atmosphere but we'll see what happens so that's a tropical guava obsidian guava no idea whether it's a, a regular sort of light green white fleshed one or a pink fleshed one no way of knowing i think this plant originally came from a dutch nursery and i don't think they listed on their website it just said tropical guava so no way of knowing uh, we'll see what happens anyway so thanks for watching the video, much appreciate it. Please give me a thumbs up, of course. Uh, you're welcome to uh, share the video. Subscribe to my channel and click on the bell if you'd like updates on new videos as they come out. I'll catch up with you all soon. Brett out for now.